Let's talk about NCP, shall we? No idea what I'm talking about here. Here's how you can use MCP in Raycast AI. Working with model context protocols in Raycast AI is going to feel very familiar. After just a bit of setup to connect with your servers, you see that they'll be available to you just like any other AI extension. If you aren't using AI extensions yet, then make sure to check out this video to learn more about it. Now let's set up those MCP servers. All you have to do is run the install server command. It's been there since Raycast version 1.98. So if you can't see it, make sure to check for updates. From here, all you have to do is fill in the form and you're good to go. If you want to browse through available servers, we've built an extension that's called MCP registry. It will give you access to the search servers command that you can use to install any servers directly from the extension. Up top, you see that you can filter by official, community or smithery servers in the command P dropdown. To use your installed MCP server, you just add mention it, just like a normal AI extension. You can manage all of your installed MCP servers in the manage servers command. And that's it for MCP in Raycast. For more news and tips about Raycast, don't forget to subscribe. But before you go, let me get real here for a second. So I've not actually had the chance to use MCP in Raycast. We've been quite busy with launching Raycast for iOS. The team just won't stop shipping. And that means we've not had the chance to actually try it out and figure out some helpful, relatable and realistic use cases to show you. I'm assuming that you know what to do with them. So why don't you share how you're going to be using MCP servers in the comments below so we can then make another video about it and hopefully include your suggestions. All right then, catch you later.